Art Allen here chatting with one of my favorite authors. I'm so excited. Karen Kingsbury, it's an honor to chat with you today. Thank you for your time. Well, thank you. I appreciate that, Brad. Good to be with you. Yes. Well, I've seen you and heard you speak, and I love this book and this film, this series. It's so fantastic. I have to ask you right out of the gate, when you get approached to turn this into a film or a television series, all the things you've done, where do you start? How do you know where to begin? Because there's just so many things to cover and so many great messages for people to to get. Well, we're in a, such an amazing season in my writing career, Brett. It's just bizarre, like how it all timed out. So on March 28th, the Baxters will debut on Prime Video. And that's based on, you know, 20 of my books that we'll now have, uh, we'll have three seasons of content that, that they'll be, you know, releasing in time. And those are based on the first three books of a series. But then five days later, my book, Someone Like You, will play out on the big screen in theaters everywhere. Uh, it debuts April 2nd. So people can, you know, literally binge the Baxters over Easter weekend and find all that hope and then head to the theaters for a love story that um, I feel is like nothing we've seen. Yeah, I think it's very exciting. I love it when books make it to series, uh, especially when the source material and what you see on screen is so accurate. It's like from page to screen, it's just like watching the book unfold in front of your eyes. How do you know, or what is your process for, for you when it comes to deciding how you wanna tell these stories? It's a two pronged question and, and the casting because the casting for this is just phenomenal. Mm, thank you. Yeah, so they're very different. So when you're the Baxters, I had Roma Downey call me and ask for my blessing so that she could turn it into a series. They let me look at the scripts and help edit the scripts, which I loved. They did a beautiful job. And I really was pretty hands off. I mean, if you have someone else making it, they're casting it, they're doing all the things. And it was collaborative. I got to weigh in. Roma was amazing. And she's incredible playing Elizabeth and the Baxters. Now, when we made our own movie, we used our savings, like the one that's coming to theaters. We paid for it. We got a casting director. We oversaw every single detail. So, I mean, that's my, my heart is just woven into every minute of someone like you, which will be on the big screen. So they're both different experiences. Both have been highly rewarding. Um, and I know everyone is going to love both of them. Yeah, I think so, too. Well, this is a great series. I, I can't wait. And it's exciting to hear we're going to get more of this. And... I love that the books are going in order. So I think people will enjoy it. You mentioned there's a lot of hope, a lot of redemption, just a lot of different messages uh, in this series. Is there one or two things, Karen, that you really hope fans get a chance to grasp onto, take home with them? I think it's awesome when there is a message that can be applied to what we watch. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, the message from the Baxters is that hope lives uh, faith is everything and redemption is possible. Whatever you've been through, redemption is possible. The Baxters have deep secrets, but they have deep love as well. And I think, you know, whether you relate to this family because your family was like that, or you always wanted a family like this, either way, when you tune in to watch the Baxters, you will find your way home. Yes. Well, redemption is key. I did it and it is possible. And of course the faith aspect I love personally, just for myself. Uh, and I think it's great, particularly in an age where there's so much content, so many things to consume and to stream, as I'm sure you know. <laughs> but really watching something too that I can have on with my nine-year-old in the room and not have to usher him out or cover ears or maybe explain <laughs> something uh, uncomfortably. So congratulations. The Baxters, Prime Video, it's awesome. I can't wait for people to see. Again, I'm so excited. I had a chance to finally meet you and share a moment or two with you. And thank you for your time. This is fantastic. Thank you so much, Brad. I hope we can talk again. That was great. Absolutely, Karen. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful day. Thanks. You too.